Hey, welcome back to another episode of Quick Tips. I am probably awake. Today we're going to talk about introducing a pattern in the beginning of the song. That way throughout the song, it kind of reinforces that pattern and you're able to have a clear cut path of what's going on in the song. So this is my song, Unstoppable. It just came out last Friday, September the 2nd. You're seeing this video on Sunday. So if you haven't listened to the song yet, check it out. I think it's probably my best work yet or the best work that you've heard so far. <laughs> Today we're looking at the project file and basically what we're looking at here is this pattern. And this pattern kind of repeats throughout the song but in different ways. So this is what the pattern sounds like. And we can see that it kind of repeats throughout the song. It's used again as a drop element or a pre-drop element. And what we're doing here is we're basically replicating the pattern of the drop. So again, if we listen to the pattern, And if we go to the drop here, we can hear that pattern again. So we can see that by introducing the pattern in the beginning, you kind of knew what was going to happen in the drop. And I think this is really helpful for two reasons. The first reason is you're kind of giving your listener a idea of what's going to happen. That way, when it does happen, it's like a rewarding feeling because you kind of had an eye on what was going to happen already. You're kind of familiar with it. And when it actually happens, it's fulfilling to hear. The second reason is by doing this, you're able to kind of get yourself out of having to have this long kind of strenuous, maybe less tense buildup because you already gave your listener kind of what to expect. So by doing that, you don't have to have this long drawn out build because they already know what's going to come. So for example, most songs I make are probably going to have a 16 bar buildup. This one just has an eight with a little pre build up two bars. So that's the two reasons. If you try this out, let me know how it goes. I think this is really helpful. But with all this being said, thank you for watching and we'll see you again on the next episode. Oh, oh, oh.